Who stepped into is uh, an awesome, and and we're honored to have her here, Jan. What last name do you? I don't even know your last. I just call you Jan when I see you. I like just Jan. Just Jan. Yeah. Just Jan. Jackson. I guess the first Jan Jackson. Jan Jackson, but the um, the first mother of of the daughter of the notorious B.I.G. The queen, the queen of it all, the original. You mind getting all these titles? Yeah, it can only be one. It's, what? We're starting early? Starting early. <laughs> shots. Jan, no shots. No shots. No shots. I'm from Brooklyn. Um, I know. I know. But Brooklyn's changed a lot. Yeah, it has. I go and I have to look at signs when I'm driving because one way is a one way is the other way and streets aren't there anymore and it's crazy. Jan didn't know about Stuyvesant Heights. Ah, no, I never didn't. Heard of that. I had to get educated when I came this morning. <laughs> Yeah, so the, uh, for those of you who don't know, the re we call it the renaming of New York, where they've changed. Uh, now Bushwick is East Williamsburg. Mm -hmm. That's a sin. Uh, you know, and uh, Bed Stuy, so that they can uh, raise the prices on the real estate, is Stuyvesant Heights. If it was good enough for us, why isn't it good enough for everybody? Shots. A little bit. But it's changed though. Even St. James, when you drive over there on St. James Place, it's a lot different now. They could have changed that a long time ago, and it would have had the same effect. We like to drink outside. We like to eat on the sidewalk <laughs> at cafes. <laughs> we're, we're special. <laughs> well, but you don't. But well, how how long have you been out of Brooklyn? Oh, fifteen years. Wow. That doesn't matter. I come back every month. My mo my family still lives in the same apartment. Where? On Washington and Fulton. Oh, right there. Yeah, mm. so right there. I have to come back and see my people. Yeah. My grandfather actually just passed away last month. He was 101. So wow. I was back every month. And you're back right now because um, you got something for the kids. This happening this weekend. Exactly. And what, once a year it. then. Well, Tiana and I decided about four years ago that we wanted to give Tiana, back to the come community. On. Come say hi, Tiana. Don't act like you're shy. Just, Tiana tries to play the wall. Hi, the people. <laughs> see, it didn't take long. I told you. <laughs> We decided, well, we decided that we wanted to give back to the community where Chris and I grew up at. Mm -hmm. So Tiana said, well, you know what? We used to do a basketball tournament back in the day. Let's try to revitalize that. So that's what we basically worked on. In the beginning, it was just Tiana and I, you know, no big major anything going on. Y'all were, really, were just playing one-on-one -on -one in the gym? Basically, <laughs> basically, it was just, I want to give back for my dad. I want something positive connected to his name. Right. And we just went for it. And now, how many years now? Fourth year going. Fourth year, four years in a row. Tiana's now graduated from college, working on her fashion thing, which we'll get into talking about. But um, do you guys, how do you guys fund this? Like, how do you get the, I mean, other than coming to us to get the word out, and, you know, I know Mr. C's been involved in some things and Every things like year. that. But, like, uh, how are you guys making this happen? The first year, it was a conjun in conjunction with the Christopher Wallace Foundation. Mm -hmm. But then his mom got busy. She had a lot of things going on. So Tiana's been sponsoring it for the last two years. Notorious and Clothing. Notorious wow. Clothing oh. doing it. Yes. I want to showcase this real quick. Showcase the shirt. Nice. Oh, I okay. like it. The Let hat. The hat is notorious. Too. All right, all right. And is there like a website, Tiana, where this stuff is at, where people could go by? Because I'm sure, like you know, now and nowadays, Jen, what they call what they call it, crowdfunding, is a big. You know, you're you really on this crowdfunding. Yo, stuff. The, uh, I know. Listen to this. A guy wanted to make a potato salad, put up a crowdfunding thing, raised thirty five thousand. You're really big. Really, on you just gonna you just gonna throw thirty five thousand dollars if you could raise thirty five thousand dollars for a potato salad. You telling me wouldn't Rosenberg? I, I would not for potato salad. I would not. But yeah, I do agree. It's impressive potato salad. No, it's impressive <laughs> that people would give money to that. So if they would give money to that, why wouldn't they give money to something like this? I would hope they would give money to this even before. Well, hold on. Is it a red skin potato or is it a regular <laughs> potato? What kind of potato salad? Hold on. Oh wait! So where can people where can people donate or get Notorious Clothing? Like, what's the you have any web information for us? Yeah. Notoriousclothing.bigcartel.com. It's still just street streetwear right now. And yes, that is Biggie's daughter, who sounds like a, a Valley girl. <laughs> yeah, don't make fun of me. It's just streetwear right now: hoodies, sweatshirts, t-shirts, hats. I'm definitely gonna expand like crazy. Expand. Expand. I'm crazy. like, it's gonna be nuts. <laughs> Leave her alone. Leave my baby alone. <laughs> Come on, Jan. You know we got to make fun. <laughs> now, Jan, for the basketball tournament, for any any kid can just show up. And how much is it to like register? Okay. There's no registration fee for the kids. Okay. Now, when you said, can any kid show up, we want all the kids to come to the park. That's a definite. But as far as teams go, no. We want coaches with their already established teams to show up. Because I don't live in New York. I don't have time to um do a, like, to vet the entire exactly. process. Okay, okay, okay. So what we do is we have coaches come, and we never have a shortage of coaches. We always have to turn people away. How do people contact you, Jen, if they want to 
Is there like an email? Is yeah. there a I phone? I have an email. Dreambiggy at gmail.com. Dang, just giving out the Gmail. It's real. Yo, rappers, listen. She's not looking for you. Yeah, you she's, not she's not signing artists. She's not signing <laughs> artists. Don't send me any tracks. Yo, I think Biggie would have really liked this. You <laughs> well, you're wrong. Oh, and he would have never heard it. <laughs> so don't bother her. He wouldn't want to hear it. She don't want to hear it. Jen, do you still listen to rap? Yes. Look, if you Tiana ask me, Town threw her head back. If you ask me who my top... Uh, play it is in my car right now. You wouldn't believe it. Well, no, who is, is it? it? Who is it? Of course we're now we're curious. Guess. Please, everybody guess. Yeah, everybody guess one person. Guess. And I'm gonna see if you guys could just really pick. I pin guess it. it's gotta be something crazy. Let's see. It's so gotta be Kendrick like, Lamar. I like him, but that's not on my own. Okay. Recently played. I think it's like Rich Homie Quan. Um, he's a, okay. Migos. <laughs> okay, see, you know what you guys are doing. Okay, I don't want to say We're going that. too that's far. Not that's yeah. not politically correct. We're going too yeah. ironic. Jay, Jay, all right, hold on. Say whatever you want to say. Flapper zombies. <laughs> no. Okay, no. Just Who? Yo, she just she just saw the flapper zombies. You know, zombies. this can't happen. Write that down as a headline. Um, that Jan, that. Biggie's family just went at the Flatbush don't zombies. Be a troll. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> don't be a troll. They'd be excited. Okay, so who is it? Waka Flocka. Flame, okay. Okay, okay. Waka, he's from Queens. Okay. Don't play. Waka oh, Flocka's like gun play. Ratchet. She gunplay. want that hood. <laughs> Jan, you out the hood now. You I still reminiscent? No, I got a switch. I cut that on and off. <laughs> that hood, she could come out anytime. She is into what my friend Dipperstein would call the filth of the filth. Yeah, yeah. she likes the, the dirty, the rotten scoundrels. Meek Mill. That's my top love one. Me. That's my love young me. one right there. Meek Mill. So. Meek's awesome. Yeah, I like... So you still like lyrics and you still like street talk. Yes. So it's not as ironic as I thought. I thought you was going to come up here talking about you like... Somebody singing and auto tuning no, and all no. that. You ain't with all okay, that. Okay, now I'm still with the gritty. The street. Yeah, I like it. I Tiana, like what, it. what do you like? Who? who? Oh, uh, this is what I, I want to see how you guys Not disagree. Tell us I something. Know. I listen to everything. I don't know. You guys like Party Next Door or is you? Yeah, okay. she likes some. Yeah. She likes some OVO. Yeah, Drake. Yeah. I'm a Drake groupie. Of course, they're big um, Drake fan. Uh huh. I li I'm not picky. I I listen to everything. But do you like the grit and grime like your mother likes? She has it on her top plate. I won't have that on my top plate. She, she really <laughs> okay, if you're, but if you're, it. Tiana, if you're trying to turn up to go out with your friends, you're getting dressed, you're getting ready to go out for a, a night out, hard body, what do you play to get yourself in the zone? Young Thugger. Young yeah, Thugger. Thugger. Yeah. He's, he's it right so now. Good. Young Thug. <laughs> Thugger. Why, why? Because you like his nails? Because he like a skirt. Hey, no, you. I like the way hey, he no talks. Shade hey, no, no shade zone. No shade. No shade. No shade. No shade. No shade. No shade. I like the way he talks. It's funny to me. Like I, I get into it. I Thug is different, why. man. He's he's very unique, man. He is very so unique. So it's just interesting, right? So you have the woman who had a child with Biggie and came up in the same neighborhood as Big, and she still loves the grit and grind. Yep. Always. Wants that gun talk. Bow, bow. Yes. Arr. Yes. And then you have the woman raised in the suburbs, his daughter. Yes. Who never experienced the grime of Fort Greene and Bed-Stuy and Fulton Street and none of that. Who's not interested at all. She knows about the Poconos. <laughs> okay? It's real. It's real yeah. in the Poconos. She hard wants out. It's real and it's hard out here it's in so the Poconos. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most entertaining piece for me. Just I the, love it. The I whole dichotomy it. of it all. So this weekend... Uh, you can email Jan if you want to come play basketball. You have your kids. You want to bring your kids. It's about the kids now. Yep. We don't want no, uh, uh, what is that, want to be professional basketball players out there oh. dunking on children. <laughs> Street ball yeah. players showing up Yo, trying to get their the shot. I went to Biggie's tournament, son, turned it out. Yeah. I know. I played with John Wallace. <laughs> um, real quick, will, will there be lots of Biggie music played? Of course. Okay. Of course. Yeah. Giveaways. We always do like the Biggie trivia in the middle. Who gets these like answers it. right? We give Guys, a prize. listen. Like fun. I party. I um recently was given an amazing gift. Um, Chris Rivers, who's Big Pun's son, mm. gave me as a gift uh, from him and his mother an outfit that Big Pun wore on an episode of Moesha. They gave me the whole thing in a frame with the picture of the episode. Wow. Like this whole, yeah, it weighs an incredible. It weighs amount. a ton. It weighs a ton. It's Just so the much outfit. fabric. It's yeah. huge. I think it would only be decent now oh. if you guys would give me a pair of Biggie's Versace glasses. I'm, I'm just saying, now that I'm Hollywood Ebro, come on, I can't be wearing Faye bands. I need a. You want to wear Biggie's Versace glasses? I, I want hip hop fans to collectively roll over in their grave oh in God. anger. That's hilarious. On a serious note, what do you guys have? Do you guys have any like, not for me, 
in life? <laughs> what what amazing stuff do you guys have? Is there any particular stuff of his that you guys have or Jack cherish? Glasses. I've tried to sneak out the house and wear them plenty of times. They're too big for my Jan face. Jan won't let you wear them. Not even that. Well, I guess no, but they're too big for my face. They always like slide off. Um, what else? I have an original. Talking to the mic. Brooklyn Mint tea that he has. Okay. And it's, hu- it's like 4X. It's huge. Um, What else do we have? I know when I did my photo shoot for Double XL, they had me in Hollywood. <laughs> they had me in one Hollywood of his jumpsuits. Hollywood T The leather five thousand one flavors. Uh, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, really? Oh my my gosh. my, my pun off is five thousand one flavors too. <laughs> That's crazy. That's hot. That's me really good. That thing is, it, I, it was like swallowing me. I was like, oh my gosh, I can't put this on anymore. It's he was big. Yo, the way Tiana talks is incredible too. I know, but you it know, by the way, me. by the way, I want you to be clear. I, when I was in. Uh, LA, I was hanging out with uh, Quincy mm-hmm. Combs and uh, Gianni Harrell. Mm-hmm. It's not just Tiana. No. Obviously, it's this whole generation of they grew up the hip hop generation's suburbs. kids who grew up rich. Gianni Harrell, whose father is the great Andre Harrell, I mean, he goes to college in Paris. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Wow, like, we, hip hop has come up. Like, people do, you know what I'm saying? But no, I, it's, I, I agree it, with you. It's it was very the, interesting. It was. It was what part of the reason hip hop has been great, and part of the reason it was something that we created was to mm-hmm. access things that weren't able to be accessed before, and to share our story. And you know, and people made a lot of money from sharing this. And now people and, like Tiana can be just huge OVO groupies. You know, it's like OVO. Oh my god! Somebody, somebody just threw up on their computer screen right now. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Tiana. You um, are also venturing out into fashion. Yes. Talk, come up to the mic and talk about um, what's well, this just, notorious line is your yes, thing. Yes, this is me. I just graduated in May, business management. So I want to just put everything that I've learned, all that hard work in college, all that stressing into my clothing line and make it as big as possible. If, so, there, if there was someone, sorry, sorry, Laura, if there was someone out there watching who is in business and has tons of money and I new ideas and they're looking and they were huge Biggie fans and they would just want to give you an opportunity to do something, is there a way that people can easily reach you? Uh, uh, yeah, on the website, on the Notorious website, on the bottom, you click contact, and all those emails go straight to my phone. I get them once all. again. I see them all once again. Rappers. <laughs> yes. No, no, not for music. This is to give her yeah, opportunities, not, not you. <laughs> yeah. Everything goes to my phone, so I see all of it. Laura, what were you gonna say? No, I just wanted to know: are you focusing on streetwear? Uh, right now, I am, but I'm definitely gonna do skirts, and I'm doing like jeans, sweat shorts, and all types of stuff. Accessories. So for for young people Super watching cute. who maybe want to go in the direction you're going, right? Are you? How did you build this? How are you making these connections? Is this all like? I mean, obviously, I'm sure your father and your mom have helped you out. I'm sure yeah. grandma's helping you out a little bit. But talk through that process. It was definitely hard because I started it when I was in school. Okay. So I had to balance school and doing this clothing line. And I just thank all my dad's fans because I think they really made it bigger That's for big. me. Because the first week when I started, I-, I sold out in like two days, made like over a thousand dollars in one day. Wow. So. I think it was just word of mouth. I did a photo shoot, and everyone was just supportive about it. Come on, C. 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 Yeah. Mr. C. C. Take my seat, Mr. C. C. Go ahead. Go ahead. Sit, down, sit down, C. We're talking about what's going on in Brooklyn this weekend, but we're also talking about Tiana's hey, clothing babe. line that she's, you oh, know. Oh, she, she making it happen. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be sit saying, down, bro. Oh, oh, I just came in to say, what's up? I didn't even know y'all was recording. Um, Tiana be making it happen. I'll be watching her Instagram, and she's moving. Every time she puts up a shirt or a hat, it just be like, yeah, I, I want one, I want one, ASAP, ASAP. <laughs> you know, I'm, you know, she's just. And now she's financing the the, the thing uh, this weekend, yeah, all by yourself. Yep. Good for you, man. Thank you. Good for amazing. you. I think it's amazing. I love when you guys come by. Your energy's always great, Jan. You're always you. laughing and smiling. You're blessed. I am. What do I have to be upset and angry about? I'm blessed. Now, Tiana, you get to see uh, your brothers, your brothers at all. Your brother. Yes, I, I miss my brother a lot. I haven't seen him. And since last summer, but I'm my birthday's coming where up. Where they live, LA? Yeah, LA. Okay. So hopefully he gets to come out here soon. Cause I just moved and I want him to see my my new place. And mm. what about and then uh, Faith has what two other kids also? Yeah. You have China, Josh, Ryder, oh, and then three. CJ. Oh yeah. right. Um, do you have a relationship with them? Yeah, all of them. I want to see all, all of them. them. I love my brothers and sister. Jan, do you get to go? You take the LA trips too? I definitely do not. But um, I don't like to fly like that. Oh, got it. I haven't been out there in a while, but I see them when they come up here. So got it. If I know they're gonna be, but it's here, all love. It's all. Oh please, those are my kids right there. Don't nobody but not say nothing about the children. The children. Yes. No, I love the kids. See, you spending this weekend out there in the park? I'm, 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 I'm gonna come through. We got the Hot 97 van doing giveaways, so I'm, I'm gonna come through one of the days and um, come out and support. You know, Jan is is uh, 
you know, you know, Jan is kind of funny because it's like when I get an email from Jan, I gotta make moves. <laughs> And Jan don't give you that. She don't hit you with the. She don't hit you with the diva check in. No, yeah. I'm sorry. Because you know she's she she's not diva Jan right now. You know what I mean? When I get the email, it's like, this is what I need. Bang 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 bang. Make it happen. Mad aggressive. Make it happen. No, it's not even Make aggressive. It it's not aggressive. What you see is what you get. I don't ask people for But anything. she don't ask for much. But when she does that means, ask, that means move your right ass. now. ASAP, move your yeah, ass. He was on our neck like, yo, you didn't hit Jan back? You didn't hit <laughs> Jan back? He's like, Laura, what was It was happening? like 24 hours that went by. We was like, yo, we, <laughs> we just got back from the holiday. Like, so, I, you know, that's, you know, I have to, when she hits me, I have to, whatever she asks for, I have to try to make it happen because she don't ask for much, but when 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 she does check in, that means she so make it happen. So, um, I love doing this. Let's make sure we do this every year. All oh, right. You inviting me back next year? Whatever you want. Absolutely. Ooh, Whatever you want. Come to that guy. Absolutely. But, but Thank you. TT, um, let's take it a step further with you. What you got going on? So when these shirts drop, right? Yes. How can you keep us in the loop so we can get the word out to the people? Um, notorious underscore clothing. That's the Instagram. Okay. Notorious with two S's. I'll say the website again. Notorious dot cartel dot com. Notorious with two S's. So if you um, we'll get your info, and that way when the shirts drop, you want us to put a link up or tweet a link card, or do all yeah. of that. Let's. Let's pull this together for the people because, like you said, there's a lot of fans of your father that want to know what's going on and stay close to you guys and stay close to the brand, so however we can help. Definitely. So, again, can you give us the information one more time for the tournament? All right. I want you guys to come out tomorrow. We're talking to the mic, Jen. There you go. I want everybody to come out tomorrow, support the Dream Big Tournament. Yep. We're going to be at Fulton Park on Ful on the corner of Fulton Street and Clarkson Avenue. We, got, we have a lot of things going on. So let me tell you that Sunday is going to be our family day. Okay. Saturday is going to be all about the kids. We're okay. going to have all our kid games, 14 and under and 17 and under. So basically from 12 to 17 to be playing on Saturday. And then Sunday we have our celebrity coaches coming out. We have our veteran game. You know, the old men always want to get on the yeah, court. Yeah, they yeah. still got it. You know, whatever. <laughs> we give them a chance. You know, let them sweat, catch a heart I attack. Whatever. <laughs> so we got that going on Sunday. And then we got our celeb coaches. So we got... Of course, the Mafia Dons. Okay. That's okay. going to be season banger going to be oh, coaching okay. that dope, team. Dope. Okay. All right. We got Black Flag, Manos coaching Mano, that yeah. team. Uh -huh. Definitely. We got Elite All Stars, which is Young Gav and Vinny Styles. They okay. collabed and got love, a team love together. Those guys. Okay. And Fab Street Fam. Oh, Street Paul Fam. Came. I love yeah. that, Paul. What Paul Kane, Ish, and Cody DeMac. They're going to be t coaching that team. Dope. So Sunday's going to be kind of more packed with games and activities and stuff to do. Hot 97 is yep. coming out Sunday. Right. So, you know, I mean, come out both days. But just come out to support. But bring yeah. the kids, on bring Saturday. the young, young, young ones on Saturday. We got All cotton candy, kids. ices, yeah. face painting, hot dogs, hamburgers, chicken, food, come. Yeah. Celebrate Biggie it's with us. Yeah. I'm in there. Yeah, celebrate Biggie with us. That's all, we, that's all we want to do. I love celebrate it. Biggie, keep his legacy alive in a positive way. Kids get to have fun. We get to enjoy seeing them have fun. Yeah. That's what the day's about. There Amazing. It is. Jan, thank you very much. Tiana, you're looking great doing thank your thing. You. Jane, you look beautiful, positive. Thank Everything you. is wonderful. Um, and thank you guys for coming by, and thanks for keeping us in the loop, too. Thanks for having All us. Right.